this is your sign to pack for your holiday ASAP because you're just going to be manic and you're going to be panicking all about it. So get your orders in, get your stuff sorted, and let's put it in this together. Timo makes the dream work, baby. I am getting out of here for two weeks. I'm going to sunny Bulgaria. No, I'm not going to sunny beach. I mean, might end up there. A couple of nights, who knows? I'm not gonna say no, am I? All jokes aside, I'm going to, how do I say it? Burgas? Burgas? To be honest, I'd never really heard of Bulgaria as like a holiday destination before. These people that I know go there often. Last year they went for like three weeks, this year they're going again for three weeks. I was like, f it, I'll go for two. <laughs> I'll make you out there, why would I? Two cocktails in hand, laid up on the beach, do you know what I mean? I booked it. Beep, booked. I had to bring my North Face check out with me today because we were being threatened with rain. Can you bloody believe it? <laughs> That's disgusting. It's rude, disrespectful. Come on, England, London, babe. What are you doing? That's why I'm off again, eh? Here's me with my cup of tea. What are we eating these on the beach though, will we? Also, just for the record, that's not mine. It's Nancy's. I feel like I've got so much stuff. I feel like I. We have like I have so much stuff. Like way too much stuff to even be able to narrow things down. And what I do is I panic buy and just panic get stuff. When actually I've got drawers full of clothes. That has clothes in it. And over here, we've got new stuff. I don't need new stuff. I've got plenty of stuff. The thing is with me, I feel like I've got loads of clothes, but I don't have outfits. Like I've got pieces of clothing. I can never like put them together. Does that make sense? Probably not. I am so excited. Cheers. Let's celebrate. Uh, what are we celebrating, you may ask? This bad boy right here. White Fox Boutique. Uh, I can't go over their clothes. Everything's unreal, so I'm giving you a haul because I feel like I haven't done a haul in the longest time. Oh yeah, you heard it, guys. I may have bagged your discount code. <laughs> I didn't may. I didn't may, I did. I bagged your discount code. Who doesn't have a discount? He doesn't have a bargain? First and foremost, I look cute, I look cozy. What am I wearing? Pajamas. Look at this little cohort pajama set. I think these are my favourite things to ever exist. Like, I wanna wear this every single day. I can't get enough of this. This is like my favourite thing in the whole world. Like, look how cute the top is. These are so flattering. We got the little shorts. They're cute, kind of cheeky, but who doesn't love that? The quality is just unreal. So, so soft, so cozy. The most comfy pajamas I own. I can't wait to wear this on like, a cutesy day. Oh, sorry, I nearly flashed you. A day where I'm just romanticizing my London life, you know, living in London, going for a cute little picnic with the girlies. Girly day out. I can't get enough. Look how flattering it is on top as well. Sorry. It's giving. <laughs> it's giving. Rapunzel, like cutesy modern day Rapunzel. My hair just is not as lu luxurious as has. Oh, luscious. That's the word I was looking for. I. Can't, I can't. I feel so cute right now. I feel so girly. Mm -mm -mm. If you're more of a party girl, we've also got some more options. Get me a vodka cranberry because I need one when I'm wearing this dress. Look at it. She is stunning. Again, the quality is insane. Like I can't go over the quality. It's so comfy, so thick. Mm. And then this dress is kind of like ruched here at the side, so it just makes it a little bit more flattering, I guess. It kind of gives. The illusion that you're like <laughs> snatched. The colours are just so cute. Can you just imagine me in a club? Um, sometimes. Why am I singing that song? You thought this snatched us. No, look at this one. <laughs> look at this. You want to get someone's attention? It's all here. Can I get our lemon ice? Okay, All the little diamondes is just incredible. I had a set from White Box that I got last year, and it was kind of similar to this, but it was a cohort. It was lilac, and it was like my favorite thing in the world. So I'm so happy to have this now. Like, I'm living the dream. I wore this to a Barbie party because I feel like I look like a little Barbie. Got so many compliments on it. It definitely was like a standout dress. So that's what you're looking for. Here she is. My go-to little summer dress. Drinks, drinks in the beer garden. I'm there. Wanna go for a little walk around the park? Here I am. 
I'm ready. I'm ready to come out. Let's do it. Chilling in the garden. Bang. Throw it on. Love it. Look cute at the same time. This is like a kind of knitted material and then it's lined inside. It's just super super cozy you're definitely gonna be comfy in this like there is no doubt about it i've seen a few of these dresses on like pinterest and stuff and i'm just like i feel like a little pinterest girl now this outfit is giving trendy on trend type of vibe these tops i've seen everywhere and I'm obsessed with them i love them like the lacy tops i think they are so so cute these skirts as well they're like the, like ruffly type of ones they give me rah rah vibes if that makes sense but this one is actually adjustable so you can have it like as long as you want or skirts should be the size of a belt so you know you know how it is already Paris Hilton to us well didn't she it's got these little like slits almost it is just unreal how gorgeous is that outfit I cannot wait to wear this top especially like I think as an outfit it's really cute but this top with jeans like even in like the autumn this doesn't have to just be summer stuff do you know what i mean and then this skirt i feel like is gonna go with the football jersey trend a little bit like if i find the right one i think it'll be perfect now last but definitely not least the grand finale my personal favorite can we have a little commotion for the dress look at it look at her the color 10 out of 10 i'm obsessed with this color just look it like ties up at the front so you kind of just you can tie it into like a bow i can't get over the quality of everything i'm not gonna lie like it's just amazing it's so worth every single penny open back look how gorgeous i am wearing a bra which i would wear a bikini top under this because i feel like it would just look better than a bra because you can like tie it up. I mean, to be fair, this bra is actually like a sick colour for this. But yeah, I wear a cute little bikini top underneath. I actually have a blue bikini from White Fox, which I am going to wear under this. I love it. Like, I love it so much. I think it is the prettiest dress. I just feel amazing in it. And that's what I want to feel because I've been falling off lately. I haven't felt like myself. I haven't felt the best. I haven't felt 10 out of 10. But I feel so good right now. Like, this dress sorry <laughs> thank you so much white fox for making me feel amazing and making my outfits look banging for my holiday listen i'm gonna be dressed so well so just just wait and see. remember to check out the links in the description box below of a white fox and also use the discount code thank you thank you thank you i really need to decide what to bring and what not to bring though because although obviously i'm going for two weeks so how can i not bring like does it matter if i overpack not really because more than likely i won't be overpacking because of the fact that i am going for 14 days so like everything will probably get used but it never does my big case like my main case that i'm going to be checking in can only be 15 kg and i can bring a little cabin case and also like a handbag or whatever what i think is best for me to start with is new stuff go through the stuff that i've bought recently or just accumulated see out of that what i want to bring oh my god who's are they Whose underwear are those? That's lovely, thank you. You know what, I'm gonna have to try this on because I don't know if this is gonna fit. Look at me hat. Look at that for a Holly Bob hat. Some of this stuff I feel like I'm probably gonna have to try on, which is kind of long because I do feel tired. And I don't really, I don't have the, I don't have the strength for it. Right, I yeah. don't know if everything's gonna fit me. I haven't tried everything on. Now I love this, love it, but I think this is made for bigger boobies, whereas I have B cups. Do these even count as B cups? I think maybe I've shrunk. Oh yeah, baby. These two dresses I've wanted for the longest time. Went into the shop one day and I was like, I tried them on and I was like, I do like them, but I'm not gonna get them today. Cause I had to get an outfit for something else. I was like, can't really be spending that type of dough today. Do you know what I mean? I'll come back next week. Went back the following week, gone. Nowhere to be seen. Online, online. We are best, um, we moan about the internet and the internet does cause a lot of bad, but listen. There's some good in it somewhere. Some good somewhere. The evenings off holidays are like one of my favourite parts. Probably my favourite part. I just love, you know, like being out all day, tanning and all that, in the pool, whatever. Get back to the hotel room, have your shower, you like finally see a little tan like popping, coming through. 
moisturise, have some crisps on the balcony while you do your makeup and all sorts. And then you get into your outfit that you were so excited to wear and you knew you were wearing it from the moment you woke up that morning. I saw someone on TikTok got this actual exact co -op. And, oh, what was her name? I love her. I think her name's Caitlin. Her name's Caitlin or something. She like does, she's on holiday with like loads of makeup TikTokers in, where are they? Ibiza? I think they're in Mallorca because I'm pretty sure they went like aloof. Anyway, sorry, I am a stalker. I'm a stalker. But I saw her in this cold and she looked incredible, but I do think she's taller than me. I mean, it's not hard to be taller than me, but I'm pretty sure she's taller than me. I'm five foot. So, yeah? Yeah. Look at this cold. I'm obsessed with it, but I just don't know if it's gonna, if I'm gonna be able to pull it off the way Caitlyn did. She looked stunning. Absolutely stunning. Look at that. That is so cute. This is the top, obviously. Oh, this is the skirt. It's like a long maxi skirt, and that's the reason I'm not too sure if it's gonna work with me. The thing is, I always bring a pair of heels on holiday. I just make sure I do, just to like be able to dress up an outfit if I want to. But I never wear them. The one time that I did wear them was in Zanti. No, I wore them twice in Zanti. I wore actually. them to like a Greek night dinner, which was kind of silly because we did golf afterwards. Although I slept. I did mini golf in heels and I slept. I wore them to, we went to the Laganas, like the main strip one night. And I went in heels and we got there like quite early because we wanted dinner. So we got there about seven or eight maybe. Or did we get there a little bit later? I got there sure. and like everyone was still in they're a swimwear because their day was only just finishing because it had probably only just begun like at four because they're out all night partying and raving oops, oops, oops. so I got there in my heels, felt like an idiot, went into a shop, bought flip flops, put the flip flops on went for dinner in the flip flops, left my heels in a bag and then I just didn't put the heels back on all night and then I just had to carry them this holiday I'm thinking chilled vibes we probably will go out a couple nights because of the fact that it is a two week holiday but I do want to relax, I feel very like tired recently don't know why, I haven't even been fucking doing anything Oh. I'm emotional. I'm emotional. She's just. She's beautiful. Oh. I love her. Do you want to get some like content on this holiday? I don't know how this is gonna go because I've been going like. If you follow me on Instagram, you know how sh my Instagram game is. I never post on Instagram because I can't get pictures that I like. Like I want to post pictures that I actually like of myself, and I always take them. Make sure you're following just in case, you know, just in case I come out my shell. I want to make more reels and TikToks because I find them so fun. Oh my god! One of the nights that we might go out, I'll probably wear this and like an empty when see Barbie doll. Oh my god, I love it! This with a tan, makeup done, hair down, all nice and clean because my hair is like. Seven days old at the moment. That is definitely good in my basket. That's definitely coming with me. Bikinis, yeah, they're coming with me because I have one white fox bikini and I wore it in Zanny last year and it's like my favourite bikini ever because it's so flattering. I love the way it fits. So I had to get more, obviously. This one, love it. This is the more than a dream bikini top in primrose. Then I've got the matching primrose bottoms and it's got like a little roost bump. Then I love this one. I think this is the Calypso print. Yeah, this is the oh more than a dream bikini top again, but in Calypso this time. Look at those colours. You cannot tell me that is not perfect. I got a different style of bottom this time. These bottoms are Belmont bottoms. Well, you know, switch it up, switch up the tan lines a little this bit. This set, I swear everyone has, but I'm just obsessed with it. And with a tan, it is gonna look so good. Look at this. The material is unreal. Like that feels such good quality. So we've got this little top and this little skirt to match. Just everything is it's got the wow factor. Bikinis are very important to me on holiday because bikinis can be like a touchy subject. Sometimes it's it's scary to wear a bikini. Sometimes you know, like your whole bloody it all ah sort of thing. I like to have a selection of bikinis when I go away because I'm like, what if? I get bored of it, or what if I just don't really like the way it looks? I'm gonna show you a few bikinis. I'm not gonna try them on, obviously, because, well, not obviously, because, like, you're probably gonna see me in the bloody holiday Olive vlog. Olivey green, is this olive? I feel like this is olive. This olivey green one. I wasn't too sure on this at first, but I was like, you know what, we'll switch up. Because I, I always go for, like, a basic triangle type of bikini. So even with the white box ones, I try to, like, switch it up a slight bit, you know? It goes, like, around and then, you know, at the back, but, I thought it was quite cute. Oh, bottoms to match. This one, I don't know where I'm gonna wear it, and I don't know who I think I am. Like, am I going to Ibiza? No, I'm going to Bulgaria. Babe. But it's like this metallic -y one, but I'm obsessed with like silver at the moment. So, I got this metallic bikini. Here, these are the matching bottoms. It also comes with like a matching bikini skirt. But obviously, 
brush it up a little <laughs> and you've got yourself a cute little fit. I don't know what I was thinking with this, but like when I went to Zanti and when I went to I went to Mallorca with my mum and my brother, we went on like a boat party and I was like, what am I gonna wear? And I wore like some dead outfit, but it was like, it didn't really matter because I was drunk anyway. Like, do I even remember that boat party? Not a lot. I was thinking if I was to do something like that, bring this, but I don't even know if they do that sort of stuff in Bulgaria. I need to actually look. Red bikini, I've wanted a red bikini for literal years. Like I went on holiday to Turkey and I was searching everywhere for a red bikini. So I don't know why it's taken me so long to get one since that, but red bikini. I've wanted one, like, forever. Bay watch, babe. I got this one, but I don't know if I liked it anymore. I loved it on the website, but not really feeling so it. So cute, little clutch bag. I thought that was just really pretty. Like, I love all the colors in it. Look how cute this little skirt is. It's like a little, I bought it as a cover up. I think that is well cute. Oh, I've got so much stuff. I can't do this. Like, how can you be an organized girl? I just can't do it. It's just not in me. Why am I so stressed out? Why, why am I so stressed out? Breathe, breathe, breathe. I can't, I can't do it. Um, also, I bought this hat because of full protect the head. Look, not middle finger. That Nancy's wearing at me. Oh my god. <laughs> it goes on and on and on. <laughs> Where did you learn how to do that? <laughs> Fair enough. It's a new day, so you know what that means. More packing! It is Sunday evening, I leave to go on holiday tomorrow. I'm getting excited, so holiday mode is creeping in on me. I did do some last minute shopping today, once again. We have got two bags of shoes. I got a new pair of Converse because I was like, I'm really bad at keeping my trainers clean. Like, let me show you all my white trainers. White. Trainers. These are my Air Force. Awful. Effed up. Sorry, I literally just burped. Pardon me. Superstars, which I don't personally think are too bad, but you know, they're not like brand new, do you know what I mean? And I only got these in freaking April. I got them for my birthday. What else have we got? We've got the CDG Converse. Obviously, these are actually off white to begin with. Look at that. That's from when I was in Magaluf. Bloody dropped a Kai breezer down me. I was so drunk the first night, so. I literally went straight from the airport, dropped my bags off at the hotel with my brother, and me and my brother just like legged it out. And we just went on one um ended up in like a silent disco bar so we can't bring those but i do my mum's like a master she's like a wizard at like getting dirty trainers clean so i'm gonna try and get her to work her magic with those when i get back i'm a size free so these were only 54 pounds so i use machine discount as well fresh converse i was gonna get like baby blue gazelles because i think they're so pretty but i was like these are gonna go with more. In Primani, I was on the lookout for some white sandals because yesterday I realised like I don't have any white sandals but unfortunately couldn't find any, they were all sold out but I did get these white flip flops because I got some other ones but someone commented on my TikTok that they gave her really bad blisters so I thought maybe I'm not gonna wanna wear them too much and I think these ones might be a little bit comfier. So I got those, they got little pearls in them so I feel like I could get away with them even with evening outfits, like it's not that deep. I also picked up some pink ones, just these. These were nine pounds, the flip flops were 450. There we go. Don't know what these are even gonna go with, but I thought they were quite a pretty color. Progress was actually made yesterday when I stopped filming. In here, I've got like all my underwear and I've got a pair of pajamas in there, the white fox ones that I showed you. So that's that, in one of these packing cubes. Packing cubes are bloody brilliant. Let me show you what I've done as well. There's the case. This is what's in there so far. In this packing cube, I've literally got bikini. I've got how many bikinis? I think I've got 12 bikinis in here, and I've got a little cover up. Like, I've got a few cover ups in there as well. There's still like a little bit of space in there if I needed to like stuff anything in there. I think I might throw these, these in. Cute little white shorts, but well, obviously they're like see through sort of thing, so they could work as a little cover up thing. All of my evening outfits, I'm going for 14 days. I think there's like probably 14 evening outfits in here actually. There's a lot. There's a lot in there, let me tell you that. I might go through this and just show you what I've decided to bring because I wasn't too sure yesterday. That one is heavy though, so I might throw that in my hand luggage or like a little case because I can bring a little case as well. I don't know what to do because shoes as well. Like I haven't even decided what shoes I need to bring. I'm here thinking like, do you know what? I'm doing all right, I'm not doing too bad. But like, I ain't even got any daytime clothes in there. I put those two dresses, the white fox ones, in this bikini bag. I fit them in. Denim skirt, which I'm gonna wear with this denim corset. I wore this in Magaluf, literally loved it. I love this outfit. I have reworn it a few times since, but it just never gets old. And I really wanna wear that with my cowboy boots. Denim shorts with one of the pink tops that 
I got sent two of instead of a skirt. So I'm just trying to make it work anyway. This one, I wore to my mum's 60th birthday, but I just loved it. This is the skirt. It's like, super cute. It's giving me mermaid vibes. And there's a corset in here, but it's the same colour, but it's like kind of, kind of a lacy material up top. But I really, really think it's so pretty. Probably just going to wear that with flip-flops, the white ones with the pearls on, because I just... Tonight. Look at this, it's like a champagne colour, it's got these little bits at the bottom, it's like an open bag but it kind of like laces up at the back so it's just really really pretty and I think this with a tan is just going to look banging shambles. I feel like I ruin all my outfits with my shoes all the time so I'm really like, I want to bring some decent shoes. Now I swore to myself I'm not bringing the white heels because of what happened the last time I bloody wore them but I'm thinking, like, is it that deep? Like, all I'm going to be doing is going for dinner. Whereas last time I was, like, going for cocktails and stuff, I was just, like, going to be pissed and, like, falling around the place, like, walking downstairs, walking upstairs, like, falling over onto my face. Didn't want that. So that's why I changed. And they were, like, just kind of uncomfortable because they felt really loose. But, listen, I've just tried them on, but I've just, like, kind of double-tied them, if that makes sense, to try and make them tighter so they feel more secure. And I've been walking around my room, like, just trotting around, you know, as you do. And I'm like, oh... Nearly fell, but that's all right. I might be able to survive with them. And they're gonna look cute with so many outfits because they're like, they're gonna go with everything. Girlies, question. Do I bring Olaplex to keep my hair in somewhat decent condition? The thing is I wash my hair every day on holiday because it just looks awful. Otherwise I cannot do anything with it. And I'm probably just gonna continue to do that even though it isn't good for my hair. I'm gonna bring my Sol de Janeiro um, Brazilian Full Play Moisture and Shower Cream Gel. And also the Bum Bum Cream, just to keep my skin looking lovely, smelling lovely. All of the above. I, I did have some stuff in this one, but I think I'm going to switch it over to this little bag here. I'm really bad at packing, like I'm just, it's too much isn't some it? Some razors. Realistically, do I need both of these? I should probably only bring this because it has SPF in it. Oh, we're going to throw it in. going to throw it in, we're going to throw both of them in. Roll on deodorant. Also, this after I'll probably put it separately. Oh. 